Hello, hello, friends and newcomers. Welcome to Hades. So this is a new-ish game by Supergiant Games, the creators of Bastion, Pyre, and Transistor. I say newish because this game's technically been in uh, pre-release, early development ever since, uh, what was it, like December of 2018. I technically have had it for a long time. Like, I remember buying it probably around the start of 2019. And I did play it on and off, but um, this is September 2020, and it has um, officially launched on Epic Games, which is where it initially was on, and then also Steam and Switch. So this is the first official, proper, like, version 1.x release. I technically could go through the patch notes, but that'd be really boring and not something that I'm going to go through here. So I figured I may as well look through this game, see what sort of things are new besides just about everything, see what things confuse me, see how good I still am. I'm probably not that good, honestly, considering how long ago I left, but you know what? It's going to be a fun time. I wanted to get back to this game because, I mean, it's super giant, like they make pretty good games. But a lot of other things happened. I think some other games released. And one thing to know about it is that it's a roguelike, which means that every time you die, you come back, you have some forms of permanent upgrades and you're highly encouraged to just keep playing more and more. And I do like those kind of games. Like I've put plenty of time into Binding of Isaac, but sometimes you just want to play a game that has a plot that ends, you know? So I'm pretty sure that's why I dropped this game in the first place. Also, I'm playing with a controller because Supergiant is pretty good at making their games work well with controllers, so kudos to them. So, alright. Enough of the main screen with our main boy Zagreus here. Uh, Zagreus is... I'm not sure if he's real, or rather if he's a real character in the mythology, but he is a son of Hades, uh, thus the name of the game Hades, where the point is to escape Hades. Yeah, escape the underworld. Um, if it wasn't, if you weren't getting vibes of it, this game is pretty heavily steeped in mythology. So you're, we're going to see some potentially familiar faces, plenty of gods, some, I'm not sure how many original characters there are, but there's certainly some people who are, I suppose, have some more artistic interpretations. But again, it's been a very long time since I played this game, so they might have just gone more into the mythology aspect. We'll find out. Enough of that. Let's hit play. Ah, yes, yeah, see? Last played March 2019. Alright, it's been well over a year since I've played this game. Time to get lost. Let's quickly... <laughs> together, let's quickly find out what things are new besides the UI... Oh. Let's hear it. Oh. Uh... Yeah, I'm just gonna... Uh... <laughs> I'm gonna give up. I wasn't expecting to... Hold up. Is this gonna take me back? I wasn't ex expecting that it would keep my place. Ah, yes, okay, okay. Let's see, let's go into the main hall for now. Oh wait, this is my bedroom. Punishment. Oh yeah, also, unlike other super giant games, this game, so the music is still great. The controls still feel good. The gameplay still feels pretty good, but there's less there's less narration. There's still some narration, but for once we don't have a silent protagonist. Okay. There. So this is where you start off. You come when you die, you come out of this pool of blood because you know that that that's pretty metal. Uh, let's see here. Uh, RB, right? I'm watching the pool of sticks, you know, the ripples in the blood and everything, and sometimes somebody pops out of there. Well, sign me in then. Yeah, so this is like the entrance hall where there's a oh cool stuff and there's like a bunch of npcs that you can interact with um including your dad who's kind of busy with a lot of stuff um as you see there's the gift ability and basically you just uh where is it where is my menu there it is yeah, you can just befriend people and attempt to befriend them as you befriend them they give you charms which uh you can affect your runs yeah, so assorted god oh, no no assorted gods of the underworld the Olympian gods Ah, yes. Yeah, Dionysus is the last one. I remember um, 
was new. Others of note, these are other characters. Hmm. Okay. Discovered infernal arms. These are the weapons. Ah, yes, the adamant rail. That was a that was pretty good. Bows, artifacts. Ooh, these are all the stuff that the artifacts are all the stuff that you can collect while you're going through the game. And obviously, there's a lot more that I haven't touched yet. Undiscovered and undiscovered. All right. Um, uh, Achilles, right? Achilles. Yeah, Achilles. The shade of Daedalus and all your time. I've never met him, no. Indeed, I have. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna guess a trophy room of sorts? Yes. These look like all the varieties of pots that you can break while you're making your escape attempts. Uh, where is my dog? Cer Cerberus is here. Or at least yes, I love Cerberus for now. Okay, fine, Zagreus. Well, I have a little chair over there. At least I'm going to assume that's my chair. There's this big piece of art because, you know, I'm not too surprised about Hades wanting some nice big art of himself. There's just a lounge here because, yeah, sure, why not? It has definitely been expanded since the last time I played, so th this is pretty neat. This is a shop where you basically, um, let's see here. Key from the Underworld can be bargained for. Yeah, so keys. Unlocking Infernal Arms and Mirror of Night Talents. Infernal Arms are the weapons, and Mirror of Night Talents are some of the passive upgrades. Nectar, for getting for friends or for trade. This is how you uh, boost friendship. Diamond, House Contractor Renovations or for trade. Oh, well, I, I think I saw something about this really quickly, but we'll we're not going to deal with that for now. What's this, though? A commemorative board adorns one of the stoic walls within the lounging area. Celebrating and proclaiming the accomplishments of those who serve Lord Hades best of all. Won't ever see my face up on that wall, I guess. <laughs> I like how it's just held up by like a gold star. These are the Furies. But how can you do this to me? Well, Megara. Blast your mirror by taking sides with him. You're standing against me. And there's Nyx. Yeah, Nyx. To be an option, oh, she has a. Of course, she has a point, proper Megara. portrait by now. You yourself shall have to choose allegiances. I have steadfastly told you this throughout our shared ordeal. I thought that both of our allegiances were to this house, Nix. Use caution with the tone you take with me, Overseer. Oh. I am the mother of the fates themselves. I do not act by whim or by mistake. Mind your own station and perform your... Angie. Yeah, so this is Zagreus's room. Uh, there's some story beats that start off here. I, 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 I think they do involve resting at his bed, but we're not gonna do that for now. Um, here we go. This is the mirror. Yeah, mirror of night. My mirror. This is where you um get all your passive upgrades that persist through the um, yeah. Through all of your runs. Let's see here. What have I? What's new? Unlock talents. Oh, there's new talents. Women in favor. Yeah, so the bonus attack. Mm, each time you exit a chamber, healing. Mm, da -da -da. Privilege status. Huh, interesting. That's definitely not something I know. Reclaim. Oh, cool. So I'm only going to assume that keys are more common now? Maybe. What is this? Ah, it's general stats. Um, I don't remember. Wait, no, was it here? Huh. I don't remember exactly where it was, but there's a menu somewhere around that basically, um, you can assortedly de help decorate Zagreus's room and fill it with stuff, and that's exactly where there's a poster of Aphrodite on the wall, even though that's his aunt or something i'm not sure it's a family tree those are already normally complicated and since this is you know mythology it only gets worse ah yes river of blood ah yes overlooking i won't back down not now or ever if you couldn't already tell like the art and the stylization is pretty good in this game as per super giant so this is our good friend Skelly. We kind of just beat him up all the time. He's our training dummy. What's this? I'll level with you, pal. You have impressed somebody well above my pay grade here, and so 
they have a little proposition for you. You listening? Let me guess. They want me to fight all the way through the underworld, having used the Pact of Punishment over there to make the going even more treacherous than it already is, and if I succeed, they'll reward me with some sort of useless trinket. Wrong. We're talking something really big here, pal. You see that thing back there? Trinket. Come on, what are you, scared? Yes, a little bit, if you must know. Act challenge reveal. Huh. So that flaming skull over there represents heat, which is basically a... It's a metric for how much more difficult you're making the gameplay. And the good thing about playing with heat is that you basically get uh, bonuses faster. I think you get, like, darkness faster. Ooh. Okay. So these are all my trinkets. There's plenty more trinkets as they introduce more people. What are these? Secret stash. So this is your starting weapon, the sword. So I mean, blade of the underworld. Who doesn't like swords, strength. really? Running with that thing, eh? Every weapon, I'm pretty sure every weapon. Every weapon has a main attack, a special attack, which is on a slight recharge. No, I guess they removed that. Cool. And then a dash attack. Yeah, so. Ooh, okay, okay. Yeah, so so X is X is basics. Uh, some weapons, I think all weapons had a form of combo. Y is special. Dashing around with A. Uh, the number of dashes you can do is dependent on. I think it's something in the mirror. So that's why I have three. I have a dash attack and then B. Zagreus has uh, this range. Ooh, what's this? Bloodstones. I, mm, the best thing to say is that. A B, his bloodstones, it's just a projectile. And as you can see, it's embedded in, in an enemy. It stays embedded uh, until the enemy dies, but if you just miss the enemy, then it comes out. Or rather, it doesn't get stuck in anything in the first place. Yeah, so since I killed Skelly, he's gonna come back, don't worry. My bloodstone has returned. Go again. Spear. Ooh, yes. You are in regal. Yes! Shield. The shield was fun, because you can just do this. You can just dash through enemies, and with the right upgrades, it gets pretty good. You can also just throw the shield, and again, with the right upgrades, it can just sort of fly around everywhere. It's great. This was this was my favorite weapon. Oh, please. It reminds me of a... Uh... Remember in Bastion, there was a gun weapon. Press R. Press in R. Huh. Okay. Order. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's certainly a death strike. And there's one weapon every run that has a little bonus or attached to it. In this case, it's the bow. Can you join me out there? But I think, for the sake of jumping back into it, we'll go with our handy dandy sword. Um, you can select one of these keepsakes per run. Um, I believe you can change them as you go in between uh, the different biomes. Like, um, basically, as you go through the separate levels of hell after each boss, you have a little hallway where you can just chill for a bit. And there's a little shop. And I believe there's another one of these drawers. So, well, how do I unequip? I guess we can. But, I mean, we'll use Cerberus's uh, keepsake just because it's pretty simple more life let's see here what happens as i leave Prepare. looks like father's changed the terms of our relationship oh so this is where you do it now that makes sense huh heat gauge exceeded what the where is where's my heat I don't need to turn the heat gauge so high to earn those bounties. Ah. Huh. Interesting. Choose any condition, terms, any conditions if you dare. Get out using the Stygian Blade. So, this is either some sort of daily bonus feature or just an every run bonus feature, which is pretty cool. And yeah, so... Wow. Heat gauge full. New bounties available. Uh, how do I go to the question mark again? I want to see it. <laughs> question mark. Uh, each condition except add some heat. 
he gauge is full, you can earn valuable bounties. One bounty the first time you vanquish the boss of each region while your heat gauge is full. For each weapon. Huh. Interesting. Um, well, maybe, nah, we'll, we'll just leave this one super vanilla. The Guinness Not this time. You start off jumping out of your window. Gust and of Ooh. Okay, so yeah, right after you start your escape, one of these show up, and this is a boon. In this case, it's a god boon, and this is Hermes. Mark, almost like a bat wing. In the name of Hades, Olympus, I accept this message. Hey boss. Hermes! Good. Cool. Hermes, at your service. Pleasure. You are the talk of Olympus. Normally I wouldn't get mixed up, but for you, I'll be making an exception. Now come on, we've both got places to be. Yeah, so there's a variety of gods that you can make boons with, and they each offer some form of different thematic upgrade, I suppose. Like, ugh, Ares offers general power and like, hmm, like attack range. Um, like attack effects. Aphrodite offers charm. Dionysus offers slowing and poison. Artemis offers like accuracy, repetition, and speed. Zeus offers chain attacks. Uh, Poseidon offers knockback, I believe. Yeah, there's a lot. So as you can imagine, with that many combinations of gods and assorted powers and with every run being different, there really is like a lot of variety every single time you play this game. Aside from that, there's also a Daedalus Hammer, which is how you upgrade just the weapon itself. And then also uh, Pomegranates, which for one, are very thematically appropriate. It's great. And for two, basically upgrade the boons you get from the gods. And if you get enough um, Pomegranates for certain upgrades, they become a lot better. Not only that, there are also tiers within the God Boon upgrades. So we'll see what we get here. Yeah, so these two are normal, and then we have a rare one. If your dash becomes sturdy, you... Oh, cool. Special is faster. I'm gonna go with Hyper Speed. Yeah. Appreciate the lift, Lord Hermes, sir. Cool! Yeah, let's go. And I... Hello. H hello, friend. Yeah, so this is a chamber. This is the starting chamber. In chambers are enemies, assorted destructibles, and pots. And then this door. Uh, some chambers have multiple doors. Uh, since this is the starting one, we only have one door. The thing in the crystal represents what you're going to be getting if you, go, uh, if you go through that door and beat the next chamber. So for here, we're going to get darkness, which is like the... Us, um, the general persistent upgrade material. In chambers are, you know, Witches. traps, enemies, enemies of different types. Uh, enemies are generally good at um, telegraphing when they're gonna do things. Like in this case, if you saw, they sort of do a flash. Like, come on, attack me, attack me. Yeah, there we go. I believe that's true with all enemies, but again, it's been a while. Um, there are also wall splats in this game. It's pretty cool. There are also... I don't think it'll work on this because it floats. But if you see that spike trap in the middle, you can also... Um, what do we have here? You can make an enemy fall uh, or walk Fly. over it and they'll take damage. And then if I break this... Yeah! If you break certain things, it'll make rocks fall, which can also do damage. Ooh, a thunderbolt. That means a boon of Zeus. Me. Let me try and lead this guy. Oh, good. He was too fast. It's okay. Yeah, Zagreus also does have hit stun on his attacks. I'm, I, I'm pretty sure it is dependent on the weapon and how much hit stun it provides. And of course, with certain boons, you can actually get more hit stun. But um, that. Mm, okay. Later on, if we get there, hopefully we get there, and Lord Uncle Zeus. I am not a terrible gamer. Uh, we'll see that there's a little bit more extra to that. Um, it appears that they've changed the graphics on the boons compared to the last time I played. They look more solid rather than just like a thing of light. Um, let's see here. What is... Ooh, that's cool. Huh. You can have that many boons? Yo, that's really cool. What is this? 
What am I doing? But why am I locking it? Oh no. Am I moving it? I guess that's what happens. Hello? What's going on? I, I don't I don't know what I'm doing there. We'll find out. Um Oh I can't Ah, I see, okay. I we're not gonna gift now, we're just gonna gift. After we learned about your plight and your existence from the goddess Nyx, all of us on Olympus rallied to assist you just as best we could. A family such as mine protects its own. Uh, Zeus? Hello? You're Zeus. Okay. So yeah, so th uh, this boost attack, this boost are special, and this is the bloodshot, the cast. Um, yeah, we're, we're gonna go with this. Cause th th I remember this being a really fun upgrade. So let's see here. To the left is a Minotaur Heart, which boosts our overall health. To the right, I don't remember what this is. I think that's Athena. I think it's Athena. Ready for them. Oh no! Excellent. Goddess Athena. Yeah, it is Athena. You arrived sooner than anticipated, cousin. And my estimations seldom are inaccurate. All for the best, of course. Perhaps you're simply faster than I thought. Dash deals- ooh. Ooh. I- I like this. I like this. Cool! And since I have increased dashes too. That's more nectar, I believe it's called. Ah yes. Okay, okay. So 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 see how these pot dudes have um like a yellow aura around them? That's a shield. That um not only does it do normally what you would expect a shield to do, it also gives them super armor while it's active. I believe there are some boons that can bypass it. I could be wrong. Nectar. Who should I get this to? But this is a shop. Uh, you see these occasionally as you go through the underworld. Let's see here. Cool. Cool. What is that? Uh, gemstones for house contractor renovations or for trade. Huh. Mm. Uh, let, let's upgrade the. Uh, let's upgrade the house. Okay, so that's a money icon, so that means, uh, that's Charon's shop. They apparently did some changes to him. You can fight him, apparently, but... I'm not gonna do that for now. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I can't really do that for now, considering I have no money. So since this icon had two, um, gods on it, basically you pick one, pick favorite. and then the other one was going to send you... Um, going to send enemies at you with some bonus attributes relative to what that god does. So, like, if I pick Zeus, then Athena will send enemies at me. And then I'm pretty sure they'll have, like, deflect properties. Whereas if I do it the other way, if I pick Athena, then Zeus will send enemies at me that will hit me with chain lightning and all that good stuff. Um, I, I kind of want Zeus. I'm sorry. Boy, I am honored. Ooh. Your call. What is? Oh! For an Olympian's age, we have such a boon. This is one stack of your god age. All four stacks are almost stronger. This is something that I remember they added relatively recently compared to when I last played. So I'm not super familiar with it. But we're gonna do this. Huh? Status curse. Victims' death attack help inflict lightning damage that harms nearby foes. So status effects. Cool. senseless punishable choice but if you wish to face the consequences so be it now i need to fight some enemies with a, to do this athena. with athena boon like properties yeah see he has a shield on oh no oh no I, I, I hit the spikes. 
Wait, why are they impervious? Hello? So even though it sounded like Athena got mad, she's not actually mad. Your father also made some questionable choices, Zagreus. But all of us are family after all. It does not affect their friendship if you've worked on their friendship at all. Ooh. Death defiance makes you impervious longer. Replenish one use. Ah, uh, what the fuck attacks? Death defiance. Mm-hmm. I think I have three lives. Uh, we'll do this. Awesome. Your wisdom guide me. What is this? Oh. I'm not entirely sure what this is. Oh, wait. Right, I think there's like the ability to remove a boon so maybe that's what that's for this is a new icon so i'm not sure what this is for oh wait oh right uh the diamonds the gemstones i, I can use for the house Oh yeah, these lions are another kind of trap. They will send, uh, step on these panels and they'll send arrows uh, in the direction that they're facing. I'll take them. Huh. Alright, cool. This is Artemis. Ooh. Oh, this is the mid-boss. I remember these guys. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, I deflected the explosion. Let's go. Anyone else? It can be in your benefit to smash pots like wherever you can, because they do sometimes have money. But I feel like the drop rate of it is not that high. I could be wrong. It, it might have been improved. Every step till you arrive here, Zagreus. Then I will probably ignore you like the rest. Just warning you ahead of time, all right? Thanks, Artemis. Thanks. Special stronger call. Any damage you it has chance to be critical. Ooh, ooh. Any damage you deal versus. I want to go with any damage. Proceed. I have, I don't know how many keys I have. Also, where are the enemies? Ah, these things. These things are annoying. They'll like float around and shoot out a laser? Uh, yeah, like that. The thing is, it's hard to, um, well, it can be a problem to get near them depending on what your build is. And especially if there's, if there ends up being like this, um, a wave of them. A Cathona key. Ensure a chaos gate. <clears throat> so chaos gates are, you know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. I may as well just show. Uh, a Daedalus hammer? Oh, okay, okay, so I'm wrong. So the money icon means money. The bag means Charon shop. Let's do a Daedalus hammer. Okay, so that's the Chaos Gate. I'll show you after. Got it. Let's deal with this first. No. That looks like a Daedalus hammer. Daedalus hammer. Ooh, 
That's interesting. My thrust. Every third attack. My special makes you lunge ahead. Let's do this. Deadless, whatever you may oh, that's mind. cool. Thank you. But okay, so when there's a chaos gate, you can choose to go into it at the expense of health, or you can just ignore it. Let's go take it. Going in. Yeah, so chaos gates are these little, um, very differently styled rooms, and all they have are um, assorted breakables and a boon from chaos. Is that what is that what his name is? I don't remember. Ooh, nice effect. Yeah, chaos. I have a feeling that the voice distortion effect and that pulsing image effect are new to me at least. Merely listen, so it's just like when I get those messages from the Olympians. Wait, you did just prompt me, Master Chaos, didn't you? Or should I have remained silent just now? I cannot offer you advice, but you were prompted, yes. You may speak freely, then or any time, despite my wishes that you not do so. Absolute silence is my general preference. It may not be yours. Yep, that sounds like chaos, alright. So, he offers boons, just like all the other gods, except um, they're basically timed in a way. You have to get through a certain number of counters um, with some kind of detriment, and then after that, you gain some decently good stuff. I'm special. Get hit for... Ooh. XP standard encounters. Okay, 75% more foes. Um, ooh. Seventy-five percent more foes. I'll do this. Yeah. An acceptable decision. This. I feel like this is new, where they tell you what you're gonna get. But again, I could be wrong. Face more foes. Okay. No. Good. And 812 darkness. Awesome. Um, 30 something. No, not quite. I'm good. Um, Minotaur heart. Yeah, we'll go with the heart. We'll go with more HP. Ah, oh, sweet! Okay. So if you find a room like this, this means that this is like the pre-boss room. How many chambers has it been? 13. Hmm. I've heard that like, you can fish now? I mean, I'll figure that out eventually, hopefully, maybe. This is a new icon? Is it going to be? Hi there. All right, it's Megara. <laughs> I have to level with you, Zagreus. For all we've been through, never once have I wanted you to meet my sisters. So Megara was, as as her title says, the first of the Furies. She was the first Fury boss introduced in the game. Uh, I remember being good against her, and then I think once they introduced the second one, I just started having a lot of trouble. <laughs> So I'm, I think I can still take her. Can't imagine why not. We had a lovely time getting to know each other. We laughed, we cried. My only regret was that you couldn't be there yourself. Yeah, despite the fact that this game is a lot more dialogue, it's very good dialogue. You don't know what you're saying. There's a reason that they're not permitted in the house. Oh, come on. One of us is going back there now. Ooh, very nice. They they changed up some of the fonts. You stay right there. No. Oh, in, in, she's impervious. No oh boy, no. I don't no. I don't like this. What else? 
No. What next? No, come on. I have a lot of invulnerability while dashing. This is kind of great. <laughs> that header was great. It's just yes. Zagreus on both sides going, Ancient yeah. Blood. Ancient blood. Huh. Achilles might know what to do with this. Bounty claim Titan blood. Uh, ah, I can't go to my codex. What is the this? Aaron years. Known also as the Furies, they are the trusted sentinels of Lord Hades, charged with torturing the worst of mortal kind, and ridding the underworld of any fool enough to trespass where they do not belong. They'll just have to try harder next time. Is there anything else here? Oh man, this, this arena design is great. Like, all the little details and just very... Ancient-looking elements. So that's the first biome done, and yeah, yeah, we have this little. Okay. Do bathe yourself in magma when you get to Asphodel. Hi, Dad. So let's see here. So this is health. This is. Looks like there should be something here. Sell. I can wash away my boons. I get money, but I like all these boons. What's this? Durations, encounters. Hmm. I'm good. <laughs> I like how Cer like all the little Cerberus stuff. So this is completely new to me. None other than those in the trusted inner circle of Lord Hades are authorized to enter the intricate chambers connecting the vast regions of the underworld. But the prince decides to barge in anyway. I barred where I please. It's fascinating how they decided to make like a mechanical take on this. All right. Oh, cool. The second time. Yes, Hello. Uh, that's all we got. Oh, cool! We can do this here now too. Awesome. It's warm out here. I'll give it that. If you're thinking the magma is dangerous, you're right, it is dangerous. But the good part is, um, it's also dangerous to enemies. If you happen to get um, enemies just like into the, the magma, they will also take it. Oh, oh, what is this? Hello, what are these things? Ah, oh, these things! I think I can also damage enemies using the big heads. Could be been a bit. Are there any more enemies? There are not. Oh god, it, it, it's hot. I am on fire. Oh boy. We got... Gemstones. Neat. Neat. What is that thing? Oh, it's uh, leapers. 
Either way, they're gonna throw bombs at me. I say ga game feels My good. Spoon switch to a new effect. Which which one was it again? Right, more damp, uh, more special damp. Excellent. <laughs> With this really cool special. Uh, the shop or Hermie? Let's go for. That, oh, that, that's a bomb. Huh, I guess only I have control over it. Wave makers. <laughs> what, a, what a great name, Wave Makers. It's a good idea to try and use the environment to your advantage because um, like other games, maybe other games, um, if you if you can make an enemy do a wall splat, they'll take extra damage. In the name of Hades. Old cat oh no. Dash more times in a row. No, I'll I'll take a dodge chance. That sounds pretty good. I have 136. Poseidon, Athena, or Artemis. Um, I'm gonna need HP. I, I may as well buy more this gemstones. One. So darkness, uh, gemstones, keys, and nectar persist through runs. Uh, money does not. I have one Athena boon right now. Let's mm, yeah, let's go with Athena. We have a melee weapon. I believe Artemis has nice or cooler boons, I guess, if you have uh, the range weapons. Hello, Mega Gorgon. Oh god, no, please. Oh no. I can de I can deflect these now, thank goodness. I remember even if you deflected it, um you would still get petrified. Right? No, oh, okay. No, 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 oh boy. Yeah, see? That was me not deflecting it. Ugh. No, okay, I don't like this. No. One more. Okay, cool. Until next time, gigantic Gorgon head. Ooh, cool. Special is stronger and can deflect. But see, this is legendary. Um, yeah, I believe it goes base, rare, epic, legendary. So this is a ooh. Uh, it's one instance of damage. Most fights don't take that long, is the thing. So I think I'll go with this. Nice. Where'd it go? Oh, oh they just went away. Awesome! Here they come. I 
I can use that back home. Uh, money. Or, ah, yes. Let, let's go to the pomegranate. Just stay in the fire. Hey, thanks. It said stay in the fire. Grants just let you upgrade between some of your boots. <coughs> so what do we want here? Now nah, we'll do this. Nice. Ow. Let's spend some money and go see our, our good friend Caron. Let's see what upgrades he got. He certainly looks better. Charon, mate. Now, hypothetically, if I provided you with, say, a thousand coins, would you be willing to give me a ride in your beautiful boat? Upriver, I should say, specifically. He still doesn't really talk, and you know, I respect it. I had to ask. What's next? Oh. A diamond. Huh. Not entirely positive what that is. So let's see here. We go for more that or some of this. Let's go with some of this. Pleasure doing business. Cast, call, attack, and special are stronger in the first 10 seconds. Wah. See, the thing is, I don't know if I have a call. We're going to find out. I do have a call. I'm not entirely sure how I get it. We're gonna find out. Um, I'm going to assume this is the boss of Asphodel. Bone Hydra, you look different. Ah, he does look different. It does look different. Okay, good. This pauses. Oh no! Oh no! Is everything paused? Huh? Everything is. Everything is paused. That's kind of interesting. All right, let's fight. Let's see, here. what do you do now? Learning in bone. Is that, is that is that a countdown? Ow. So sim similar to how Megara had phases, uh, the phases of the Bone Hydra, if I remember correctly, it should at some point send out little Hydras out of the lava at the side of the arena. But again, oh yes, there we go, impervious. Ooh, there we go. There's the other ones. Each one of these has a specific type of attack based on the color that they are. Oh no. Please. Please, please, please. I want to live. I mean, I do have extra lives, but still, I would like to live. Ouch. Ouch! Oh yeah. And you can't, um, continue attacking the main Bone Hydra until you kill all the minions. That's a thing. Oh no, oh no. Not yet, not yet. Don't, don't use the call yet. It looks like the call is basically just, um, like, it's basically just meter that you gain by doing it and such. By just, you know, playing the game. Oh, that's not good. 
Why isn't it good, Zagreus? Tell me, why isn't it good? I do not appreciate that. Oh no. Remember there being health items in this arena before? Oh no, I'm at 4 HP. No, I refuse to die right now. At, at this, at that particular moment, I refuse to die. So, so as you saw, I took a fatal hit, but because I had um. The Death Defiance perk from the mirror that lets me uh, uh it lets me uh, stay alive and it re revives me back to uh, half my back HP. Also, what just happened there? We're almost at four, so you know what? Well, we'll... It's time to make a splash. Cool. Awesome. Hydra vanquished. Cool. No, Zagreus, get out of the lava. Off? No. Should fetch me something good back home. Bounty claim. Diamond. Cool. So yeah, back when I kept playing in 2019, this is where the game ended. So you would. You would go here, and then all of a sudden Zagreus would just uh, die. <laughs> and then it would say the um, that like the, his story has ended for now, but ours continues. It's something like that. Should I take the trade? What's next? Take me up. There. So I'm definitely still rusty at this game, but I'm not absolutely terrible. The fields of Elysium. Elysium? Huh. Where? You know, if I was permanently dead, maybe I wouldn't mind all this. So this is the good part of Hades, or the nice the part? The rare, heavenly splendors of Elysium, reserved for only the most great of mortal souls. Spread forth luxuriantly, all about the fire-stepping prince. Luxuriantly? Really? Uh, yes. Give me the pomegranate. Bright swords. Bright swords. Whoa! These, these things fight back. Oh no, that's a trap. Where's the trigger? Is that him? The eyeball? Hello? That... Hello? It reformed! Hello? Lightning attacks, spe spe stronger special, deflect. Let's go with stronger special. That's nice. Um, um, I wish I could see how many key. Oh, I can. 26 keys. Let's go with next. That's a, that's a bomb. Oh, the trap. Oh, huh. the next? things here return. That's interesting. What the? Floating sword? Hello? What is that? Oh no. Hello? What? What is that?
Hold up, do does my god call reset each room? That's interesting. Die, please. Aha, it died from the trap. Nectar bottle. Take it. What? Shop or two boons. Let's go with two boons. Also, this place's design is pretty great. Like, I am liking this color scheme. Um, let's go with Poseidon for now. By oceans, they are filled with danger, and not just water, little Hades. Any of the dead you face, they met their mortal end at sea and not on land. Cast boons. We'll knock the with knockout wave effects, but also rupture foes. Ooh. Well, do I have any knockbacks? You can check. Oh, that's so good. I technically do not have any knockbacks, so let's go with this. This is just one of those, um, like resource booster effects, so the earlier you can get it, the better. You really missed an easy shot here, Zagreus, but I will not. You'll see. Forgive me, lady. Whoa, Arthur. those traps! What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Take a boon and then be off. Fine, Artemis. Fine. Cast critical against armor. Ooh, that's good. Well, but only criticals. And what's my crit chance? I wish I could see my crit chance. I don't think it's very high for what it's worth. But I'll do it. Because uh, the faster you can get rid of armor, the easier it is to manage certain things. Uh, restore HP. Random item offered from the Well of Charon. I could. I'll take both. Worth it. What do I get? Yarn of Ariadne. The next boon you find has upgraded rarity. Cool. Uh, that's hmm, money or health. Let's go with health. Hopefully, I can get a boon in. The next room after. Long spears. The eye. Also, it looks like my call meter, um, like refills or it resets at the end of every room. Which is, which makes sense. Basically, um, incentivizing you to uh, use the call more often, I suppose. And also, it means that in a longer fight, it does prove more useful. Just like uh, when we were up against the Hydra. Okay. Yimmy. What next? A Daedalus Hammer! Give it to me. Hmm. I don't think there's another door somewhere. I'm not seeing it. Shields. Bye. Bye. Welcome. Nope. Even deflected the explosion? Wow, lucky you. Enjoy. 
enchantments yeah. for my weapon. Ooh. Ooh, that's cool. Ooh, wait, I like this. 5% of my current... Nah, we'll go with this. That'll do. Fast strike hits twice. Let's go. Alright, we need a boon. Zeus or Poseidon? Um, Zeus is knockback. And... I mean, Poseidon's knockback. Zeus is more of this. I already have plenty of damage. But... May as well. Sucking butterflies. Hello. Why, why, why are butterflies soul sucking, Gregorius? Why, why I'm being targeted? No, but I kind of need to kill everything else first. Otherwise, they turn into these things. No. This is a this is pretty good. Stay away from me. Old spike collar rank up. Cool. A boon Ooh. for a boon. Duo. Hold up. What? When you knock foes away, they are struck by lightning. The issue is I don't have a lot of knockback right now. Dang. I would want this. It'll replace Divine Flourish. Strong can deflect. Just, uh, ooh. I think I'll go with this actually. Athena won't mind, will she? Time to fight. Like, if I had more knockback effects, I would have taken the duo, but I don't. Pomegranate. Heart. Let's go with the pomegranate. You know, I realized technically I do have a knockback, but it's on the last hit of my um my standard combo, which I'm not doing so so much right now. Oh well, it's fine. We've already gone this far. Any strength. Shop. We're going to the shop. We have a lot of money. A 
pomegranate piece? I can gift. I must gift. Also, what is this? Oh, that, that's a fancy looking necklace. I uh, may as well buy everything. Here's the fee. Cast call God Gauge. Charges up faster when you deal or take damage. Yeah, let's do that. Tart and tasty. Brilliant repose. Oh, I see. Gift. Gift. You enjoy that, mate? When it comes time to reconsider your price structure, hope you think of me. <laughs> Cute. Oh my god, it's LB. I'm dumb. I keep hitting the wrong button. Alright, I guess it's time for another boss. Whoa. Oh, wow. A minute's worth? Hold feet. Easiest? You'll walk not one more step toward the light of day, so long as I am here. Two against one. Seems hardly fair. Oh well. Let's kill him and be done, King. Theseus? The Bull of Minos? You two are legends. I'd be honored if we had a sporting contest here. Ah, uh, a naked attempt to sway me from my convictions. Defend yourself, you blaggard. And may the gods show you some mercy, for I shall not. Oh, man, that was cute. Okay. Oh, big swings. All right. Hold you, monster. Ooh. Okay, fine. We're going to take care of you. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Ooh. Okay, alright. This is definitely the point where I start getting rusty. Oh, jeez. Attack me if you dare, blackguard. Either way, I shall crush you. Whoever decided on that on this voice delivery, it, it's great. <laughs> Which really could could be said of this of the entire game. Try all you like. No, what? Come on, I almost have full god gauge. No! Oh jeez. I I feel like I'm gonna die again. Oh he's he's ramming me. Now, Hellspawn! Look out, Asterius! Ooh, jeez. Okay. That cheering's not for you, monster. Oh! Hello! Dog, I could I couldn't oh, no. see that. Well that's my last life. I am not finished yet! Oh, come on! Oh, blackguard! How oh, your spirit must be quivering inside! Come on, if I can get rid of one of you, I'll be good. Nope. Oh, come on! Get rid of Theseus. Then get rid of Theseus. Come on. There we go. There's one. See that bull man? Oh, I see his attack now. When he does the slam, it sends out waves. See. Nope. 
Oh, oh my god, I thought I died there. <laughs> but I'm very close show. to death. Oh, I can't seem to open it. Ambrosia. Ooh, it's the fancy stuff. I'll take the service exit, thanks. King Theseus has fallen to the likes of you. Don't forget Asterius. Any boons worth giving up? Not really. Plain foes have a 50% chance to drop HP. Yes, I would like that. I'll also take more gemstones. What's next? I can do this. I can do this. A labyrinth? Oh my god. And then the door. Is is, is that it? Ground floor. Temple of sticks. Have to keep going. At last, the willful prince has ventured all the way up to the surface of the mortal realm. Yet still, he is encased within the earth itself. The gateway to the underworld. A threshold from which there is no escape. We'll see about that. Am I going to make it out? Probably oh, no, not. Not this. <gasps> Cerberus! Good boy! Multi-headed Cerberus stands vigilant before the underworld's entryway. The tales of what happens to those foolish enough to attempt to pass are far too graphic to but, describe. But look at those faces, he's such a good boy. So it's really come to this boy. After everything we've been through. Well then, this is how it has to be. There's nothing left to say. Except for on your guard. Can I not? <laughs> no, but seriously, boy. I know why you're here. There has to be a way to make you look the other way. What if I help you with the Sater problem? Would you let me go? Please. I have to find Mother. <laughs> After a moment's hesitation and deliberation, the voracious hound of hell barks once, affirmatively toward the prince, who sets off in search of something that can sate the monster's appetites. Good. Now I just need to head off the beaten path here and see what I can find. Hello, my friend. Eh. Huh. 100, 300, 300. That's kind of interesting. Alright, I guess we'll uh, head this way for now. What? Whoa, okay. That's interesting. I don't want more HP. Let's see what's in here. You. Ooh. What kind of trap is this? Oh. Interesting. Cure? Not poisoned at the moment, thanks. Oh, what? What's going on here? <laughs> Big rats! Poisoned. Oh no, I don't like it. Could you not? Interesting. All right. Back.
Oh, this, <laughs> this is a jam. <laughs> the most gigantic vermin I've ever seen. Oh, that is a big boy. Oh, that was a trap. That was that, That's a very big trap. I, oh, oh I'm poisoned. I see now. Oh no 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 no! Don't like this. Oh no. Oh man, I died. That was a lot of traps. But also, I got farther than I expected. I totally expected myself to die at that third boss. Uh, so did everybody miss me? But I mean. I that was pretty good honestly um the core gameplay of the game hasn't changed really it just feels like things feel better now like maybe it's just the fact that um I'm de-rusting and there's just so much more but it feels like it's not necessarily easier but the gameplay feels like there's more options and you feel more powerful if that makes sense Again, like I said way at the start, this is a game that I would like to get back to just to, or mostly to see everything that they've done now. And I mean, it, it, if you can't tell, it's a good game. And again, there are six, seven total weapons. I honestly don't, I don't remember right now. I had the sword, the spear, the shield, the bow, and the railgun. I, I believe there are also gauntlets and a pole arm maybe more i'm not sure either way i mean it does feel good to play the game again everything does still f feel great look great sounds great yeah also it is very nice having a um like a pause run feature although i guess not having it is just a bit more of um like an archaic standby like it's just something left over from all the early days or maybe that's just how um a shorter roguelike would end up working because that took about an hour that's only four biomes and i don't i wish i did check how many um chambers that was but either way hades is definitely still a fun game I would like to say that it's definitely a better game than when it was um, all that time ago. I mean, that of course, that's what people strive um, for their games to be. They want it to be better over time. So yeah, it is. this version is the Epic Game Store version. It should not have any differences between the Steam version and the Switch version. However, I do believe that they put out an update saying that there will not yet be cloud saves on the Switch version um, immediately. That'll be coming out a future time for... I don't know x y and z reasons but yeah if you're interested go check it out I, there's a sale right now to celebrate um the launch of version 1.0 so yeah thanks a lot everybody